Good evening, and welcome to the sixth grade winter concert for Beats Band. I am Isabella Klimovitz. I play flute. Our first selection is March Across the Seas. This piece is written by Bruce Pearson and Ryan Nolan. Now, from parades to the concert stage, marches from for the core of the American band tradition. Associated with the Christmas and holiday season, it was actually originally written to be sung for American Thanksgiving. We are dedicated to we are dedicating this to Wade in hopes that he calls us. <laughs> <laughs>
Kevin Bertolio and I play out the saxophone. Our next piece will be Banana Boat Song. This piece is a traditional Jamaican folk song arranged by the by Ryan Nowlin. It is a work it is a work song originally sung by the laborers to pass the time as they loaded the bananas on the boat. Devin. I play the trumpet. Our next piece is entitled Indigo Rock. It is a straightforward blues tune with a rock feel. It is written by Bruce Pearson and Ryan Nolan.
I am Sean Alcock and I play French horn. For our next selection, we will play Raiders March, written by John Williams and arranged by Jack Bullock. This is from the popular movie Indiana popular Indiana Jones movie.
Good evening. Thank you so much for coming tonight. We are so very proud of what these students have done. Can you give them another hand? <laughs> Raise your hand if you have class on A days, A day classes. We've only seen them, I think, twice since the break. You put your hands down. <laughs> We're so glad to have Wade call us, but then. <laughs> um, and Mr. Rumpola called me last night and he said, do you want to still have this concert? And I said, you know what? These kids went through all of their music on their rehearsal last Thursday, so I think we're good. And I hate to jinx the last piece, but wow, we are pretty good. They worked really, really hard. And, and I, I said at the earlier concert, that's the best thing about teaching middle school is sixth grade. Watching them go from not being able to play one single note, not knowing how to hold their instrument, to some really nice sounds tonight. And they're playing some music that um, is a little challenging. It's, it's not your normal sixth grade first concert music. Um, we we kind of like to play things that might keep their interest, so they're a little bit harder. <laughs> they have more than six notes in them. We had to learn some new notes. <laughs> um, so again, I, I think they're doing a great job. The announcers didn't get a chance to practice announcing because we were supposed to do that yesterday afternoon in our rehearsal, and I thought they did a great job too. Um, there was a white piece of paper that was out on the stamp, and it was next to the programs. And it's just some information about scheduling for years to come. Um, seventh grade is, is just almost like sixth grade. You still meet every other day. Um, everything, the grading is all the same. The only thing that's different is instead of being grouped by instrument, you know, the flutes and the oboes together, the clarinets together, the saxes together, and so on, they're grouped by families. So we have two woodwind classes, and those two classes are mixed woodwinds. We have usually two brass classes, and I usually include the bassoons in that brass class because they tend to play the same thing as the trombones and the baritones and the tubas. And then we have a percussion class. And then those five classes together would make up the seventh grade band. And in eighth grade, we have what we do, it's like two mini bands. It's all instruments represented in two different classes that we put together for a concert. And then I think what most people get wrong is high school band. So there's a lot of facts on there about high school band. A lot of people think, oh, I can't take band in high school because I can't march. You don't have to march. Or some people only want to march, and that's an option too. And we have just an amazing marching band, and some of those students are out here now, and they're fantastic. They get Virginia Honor Band every year, which is the highest award that can be um, earned as a high school marching band in the Commonwealth of Virginia. So make sure you take a look at that, and, and, and hopefully you'll all sign up for band next year. Yay! <laughs> all right, we're getting ready to start our last piece, and we have an announcer. Good evening. I'm Tyler Williams and I play percussion. We'll now perform Robin Hood and the Golden Arrow by Robert W. Smith. This piece was inspired by the classic tale of Sheriff of Nottingham Archery Contest. Thank you so much for coming to our first concert. We hope you enjoyed it.
us. It'll go first row to fifth row. Push your stands forward so that people are able to walk between the stands and the chair.